On our last show before break, we did a bit with Addison Ray, where she taught me eight viral TikTok dances. Now, we recognize that the creators of those dances deserve to have their own spotlight. Jimmy Fallon invites TikTok creators to perform their viral hits following the Addison Ray controversy. On Monday's episode of The Tonight Show starring Jimmy Fallon, the host virtually welcomed the creators of five viral TikTok dances to discuss their success and perform their routines. Right now, some of the creators will join me to talk about how their dance went viral and then perform the dance themselves. Their appearances came after the late night host was criticized for having Addison Rae perform the viral dances on the show without giving credit to the people who created them, many of whom are black. First up, Maya Nicole Johnson and Chris Cotter, who created the viral dance to Cardi B's hit Up. It's big bags busting out the belly band, take them net, work them back, party back, and know you. B if it's up, then it's up, then it's up, then it's up. Yeah, the dance is so viral, even Cardi has noticed. That was really exciting. She posted our video two times on her Instagram and then one time on TikTok. So yeah, that was a good experience. Next up was Young Prince, who created the Corvette Corvette Challenge. Corvette Corvette, hop in a jet like that. Hit me like that, hit me now like that. They were like, pop, why you all like that? Why you talk like that? Why you all like that? I want to be an all around performer and entertainer. Will Smith and Kevin Hart, they're like my inspirations. I love their journey. Then there was Flyboy Foo, who created the Laffy Taffy remix, and Indy, who choreographed the accompanying dance. Take that Laffy Taffy, girl. Bring it back and drop it, girl. You shocked me because, like, I wouldn't even expect it to go viral. Dance creators Mac Daddies came up with the Blinding Lights Challenge. <laughs> Foot move, actually, that was like our go-to dance back then. So we put that in there, we added some hand movements, and uh, it just kind of went together perfectly. And last but certainly not least, Kiara Wilson, who created the mega viral dance to Megan Thee Stallion's track, Savage. I'm a savage. Yeah. Classy, bougie, ratchet. It took me about 30 minutes to choreograph because I kept changing the ending. I never expected it to blow up like it did. I just did it for fun, honestly. Yeah. Then I just kept seeing it grow. Celebrities were doing it, little kids were doing it. It was the best. But I would have to say seeing my dance bring joy to people throughout quarantine was definitely the best part. In February, ET spoke to Kaylin Castle, Kaishel Dabney, and Queen Kamira, members of the Atlanta-based Collab Crib. I do understand that Black creators are trendsetters for a lot of, you know, the content that is being produced on TikTok. But at the same time, there's a way to involve yourself in someone's culture without it becoming cultural appropriation. They opened up about being black creators on TikTok and the cultural appropriation they've witnessed on the platform. It's definitely really frustrating. I can't sit here and say it's not. Sometimes it does mess with your mental because you're like, well, dang, like, because you're trying so hard and you're doing exactly the same thing as other people. You want people to appreciate us, but yeah. at the same time, it's a fine, I think it's more in the educational background where they have to educate themselves before they can and like, you know, be involved. Yeah.